Tacoma police are looking for two kids who beat up a man waiting for his wife to come out of a convenience store. Tonight, we hear from the victim who says his attackers aren't even trying to hide. Coma Force Marley Ginter is live where it happened to let us know how he's doing. Marley? Dan, doctors say it could take up to a year for his skull fracture to heal, and this happened more than a month ago. Now, we're standing off of South 12th Street in Tacoma. This is where he was parked, just outside the Easy Food Store, when he says he suddenly became a target. He deliberately put his pedal up high, his left pedal, and hit the front of the car. Doug Diamond thought he was just dealing with a rowdy kid. So he said, get out of the car. Diamond says the kid rode his bike into the front of his car on purpose. But when he stepped out to confront him, Diamond says he was blindsided by the kid on the bike and someone else. I turned and I was going to walk to the front and look at the damage. And he clocked me from, from outside my view and hit me hard enough to do the damage to my lip my black eye and the skull fracture on this side. He was kind of, he was actually sort of laying on his side at the back corner of the car and all I saw was this pool of blood coming out right here. Paramedics rushed Diamond to the hospital with severe head injuries, but it wasn't until a priest came to visit him at the hospital that his wife Janine realized how seriously hurt her husband was. I think my very first thought was, oh my God, I'm a widow, and then, oh my God, I need help, and oh God, what happened? A surveillance camera caught both suspects on tape. The Diamonds say they see them all the time around the Easy Food Store in Tacoma, but they won't rest easy until police catch them. I think they're a huge danger and a menace, and I think that someday it's going to, if they're not stopped, it's going to be yours or yours or mine or somebody else's. I don't think they show any remorse. I think they're going to kill somebody someday, and they better be watching their back. Now, police say one suspect is in his early to late teens, the other one in his late teens to early 20s. Now, they have been seen quite often at an apartment complex right next door to this Easy Food Mart in Tacoma. If you have any information, call police. There is a $1,000 reward for any information leading to an arrest. Live in Tacoma, Marley Ginter, Como 4 News.